Hey everybody, um, just here with the quarantine report for April 1st, April Fool's Day. Um, I relocated for a couple days um, because I things are a little tense at the other place. It's uh, a lot of helicopters overhead nonstop. It feels like a battlefield. And I have basically been in my truck in the parking lot. So, yeah, and it's just a little tense and people aren't really speaking. It's just weird. It's weird how you can be so alone in a building of people, you know? But um, instead of that, uh, my friend, who is a painter, offered to let me come here and do my laundry and help me with my taxes and help me film uh, video projects, which I'm really excited about, um, and help me print my art by mail. So I'm going to be here until all those things are finished, and uh, which might be a while, because if you can see all the laundry over here. Um, but that's all mine. <laughs> I'm still not really wearing pants, so I think I'm still winning. Have a good day. Um, I thought while I was here, maybe I could just show you around a little bit. Um, it's pretty cool. I haven't been in, like, just a real white um, painting studio, like, since college. Um, it's bringing a lot of memories back, but... Um, it's my last day at Skips. You can see I'm still here, just waiting on the last little bit of my laundry, and I'm, I'm going to try to interview Skip um, before I go. Um, I've been here a whole week. I left um, just to get a bunch of things done and also just to get a little break from some of the tension at the other place and yeah it's been really good um, so that's that I'm going back this evening and oh the exciting thing is I'm going to be interviewed by Douglas Rushkoff for his team human uh, podcast which is a big honor because it's kind of exciting like I say all the time that I want to work with my heroes that's like something I think about a lot like and so I feel like this is one of those occasions. So that feels really good, and I'm looking forward to it. I will. And I am in my orifice office, Renaissance headquarters. Um, it's actually raining outside. You hear the rain? It's sunny and raining, but that's the view right now. I used to have that hanging up in my bedroom in high school. I just found it again recently. And I put it in here. I am staying in my truck by choice. I still have a room inside. Um, and although my situation hasn't changed, I, um, as far as I know, still have to move at the end of the month. But I think that they actually kind of missed me. Everybody's been really nice. Um, so even though I'm out here, uh, sleeping out here more for my own fun and amusement, um, and it's very comforting to me to be in my truck, um, yeah, it's going okay. So, and the really exciting news is that I just finished a podcast interview. I was interviewed for Douglas Rushkoff's Team Human podcast, which Team Human was the book that inspired me to start the podcast, Viva La Renaissance. And there's so many things that he and I have in common. He's like a really great kind of old school New Yorker. And uh, if you haven't read the book, I really recommend it. It's... Um, it's both, you know, uh, terrifying and hopeful, uh, just about sort of like the long-term impact of our collective technology addiction and sort of where we want to go with it. Like he really got me and really gets my work and it was really amazing and refreshing to have a grown-up conversation with somebody about it who understands what I'm trying to do. So yeah, it'll probably take like a month or so. I guess for it to get come out but right now I'm just getting ready to enjoy this rainy afternoon working on the art by mail great rainy day isn't it give you a little tour of my desk oh that's all the food I didn't eat I've got the fire going and I think I'm gonna watch uh, Hellier I'm gonna be part of that um, yeah that's what's going on later alligators